What is target CPA bidding in Google Ads? That's what I'm going to be talking all about in this particular video. I'm going to go through what exactly it is, if it's right for your kind of business. Importantly, what happens if you set the wrong target CPA amount? So you definitely don't want to miss that part. And I also show you where you can find it in your ad account so that you can either set it up or change whatever the value is. Alrighty. Definitely want to check it out. I actually love target CPA bidding. We often do it for many of our clients. So let's go dive into my live Google ad account. I'm going to show you exactly what I mean. Oh, and don't forget, like and subscribe. So here we are in a live Google ad account and I've actually already gone into one of my campaigns. And as you can see here, we have set a target CPA, CPA amount and we've set them to be different for these different ad groups because the different ad groups have different keywords. So you might be wondering, what is target CPA bidding? It's essentially you handing over the bidding reins to Google and you're saying to Google, bid what you need to bid to give me leads at this particular target CPA amount, which you set at this ad group level. So for this particular ad group, I said, I want to, my target CPA, my target cost per acquisition or CPA amount is $20. Go away and see if you can get me leads for that target amount. And it comes in at $36 close um, but also not wildly off as well this particular ad group as well it's got a target CPA amount CPA amount for $41 and the leads are coming in at $51 all right so rather than doing the maximized conversions bid strategy which is basically saying give me leads at any particular cost I actually do have a separate video on maximized conversions I'll put a link in the description for that you're kind of saying, I don't want leads at any cost. This is kind of like, this is my North Star of my target uh, lead cost that I'd like to go and get. But obviously, Google's not completely constrained to it. Obviously, if you set your target CPA amount um, lower, then you're going to be missing out on some impressions. So if I scroll across here, you'll see that this particular ad group that's got a lower target CPA has got a lower impression share than the one that's higher. And that's because you're giving Google like less scope to buy traffic because it's kind of got to get leads for cheaper. If I show you real quick in another account, this particular account was doing manual CP CPC bidding. They then switched to target CPA bidding, but they set their target CPA like really, really low. They basically, their campaign completely died off. They were getting no impressions and no clicks. And then they've kind of switched uh, bid strategy. So their impressions are boosting back, back up. But this is kind of the consequences if you set your target CPA amount too low is that your campaign doesn't get any impressions. And then obviously you don't get any clicks and then you kind of get no traction. Okay. Going back to this original uh, account. So, uh, to set your target CPA amount, you go to the settings section. You go to bidding here, and that is where you set your target cost per acquisition. Obviously, you do it at the ad group level. Alrighty. So we actually real, do really like target CPA bidding, particularly if the cost per lead is really important, that it doesn't kind of, you know, Google doesn't go crazy with it and they come in too high. And um, so long as you're not this balance between setting your target CPA amount to a certain level that you don't miss out too much on impressions, but also the CPC is not too high and uh, you can find a middle ground there as well. If you want to migrate from a different bid strategy to target CPA bidding, you might be wondering, what do I set it to? Often we do, we set it at the level that you are currently getting leads at with whatever bid strategy you're currently running. So say you're doing manual bidding and the leads are coming in at $50, we'll set our target CPA amount to be $50, see how that goes. And if it's still too high, we look to lower it uh, slowly, but I wouldn't make any massive changes uh, too quickly, especially if you've got a campaign running and it's ticking over nicely. Alrighty, hopefully that explains um, this particular bid strategy to you. If you've got a question, comment below. And if you like this video, hit that thumbs up icon and subscribe to my channel for more awesome videos. Thanks for watching.